there's nothing between life and death. Either you're alive and you're living life, or you're dead. I'm considered as an explorer, whatever that might mean. Well, Mike Horn is just an ordinary man. Somebody that loves adventure. Kind of trying to write history in the world of exploration, from circumnavigating the world around the equator to climbing some of the highest mountains without oxygen and external support crossing both poles, North and South Pole. Sailed about 13 times around the world. So um, what do I do? I kind of um, do what I love, and that is exciting. A lot of the things that I've done has never been done before. So the only answers you can find is what you have inside yourself with the knowledge that you have and the experience that you have. And if I know 5%, of the answers of all the questions that I have, that's enough for me to go. The answers of the rest of your questions you're going to find on site. Ye who can adapt will have an advantage. And I can adapt very quickly. So sometimes when I leave on these expeditions, I only think that I have the knowledge to go out there and do what I do to be solo around the equator, there's so much that can happen. But I don't think of the things that can happen to me. I only think of the things that I can do. Following the equator, I was put in front of a death squad. They shot the guy next to me. Sometimes, for me, it's not nature that became my biggest enemy. It's actually people. Luckily, they didn't shoot me first and I was lucky to survive. You need a little bit of luck, but that luck you must provoke. That luck you've got to find. That luck you've got to go out there and look for it. My father taught me very quickly that if I come back home and I do my homework, I'm free to go. So I had one rule as a kid, and the rule was that at six o'clock at night, I must be at home. And you give freedom to somebody that deserves it. I didn't have to tell my father what I was going to do. So that was kind of exciting for a kid to be able to have a bicycle, cycle away. And I think that spirit that I had as a boy stayed alive in me today. I was very fortunate to, to have a wife for 25 years. Unfortunately, she passed away, but she supported me through everything I did. She was the pillar behind me. She was the anchor of my life. She gave me two beautiful daughters, and I have an amazing relationship with them. It's like the Oscars in the world of sport a little bit, and I think it's because I was alone in my category. They could only give it to me, and that kind of changed my life. You're standing next to guys like Tiger Woods and Roger Federer, Michael Phelps, the swimmer, and it was, it was a great honor for me. Mercedes-Benz came to me and, and Panerai came to me, my current sponsors, and they said, we like your philosophy, we like the way you think. Can we sponsor you? So I said, yeah, of course you can sponsor me. And that's where this hunger for adventure became something that we could share in different brands. And I think we're all adventurous in one way or the other. And if we're adventurous, we've got to stay hungry. The moment you're satisfied is the moment you die. <laughs>